The overall goal of this method is to improve the efficiency and sensitivity of high-performance liquid chromatography post-column derivatization, or PCD, methods through the use of a reaction flow column. This method can help answer key questions in fields such as pharmaceutical, biomedical and environmental sciences, where compounds that have low response to HPLC detectors are analysed. The main advantage of this technique is that no reaction coils are needed, as mixing of the column effluent and derivatizing reagent occurs more efficiently than in conventional methods. This method has been used to provide insight into antioxidants, amino acids and phenols. It can also be applied to other class compounds such as thiols, metals, antibiotics and toxins. Although the entire sample is not derivatized, due to lower band broadening, the concentration of analyte within the effluent flow stream is higher than in conventional post-column derivatization analysis. To begin this procedure, prepare the HPLC instrument with 100% water on line A and 100% methanol on line B as the mobile phase, purging the pumps as per the manufacturer's requirements. Set up the HPLC instrumental components and the additional derivatization pump. Following this, set the UV VIS detector to analyze at a wavelength of 520 nanometers. Connect the inlet of the reaction flow, or RF, column to the HPLC instrument. Connect an outlet peripheral port to the UV VIS detector using a 15 centimeter length of 0.13 millimeter inner diameter tubing. Next, connect the DPPA.